Now, Channel 3 Early Warning Weather with meteorologist Mark Dixon. All right, across Connecticut, we are trending a little bit milder, of course, compared to yesterday. Our normal high for this time of year is 42 degrees, and today we'll take a run at the 40 degree mark. And as we head forward in time, our sky will turn a little bit brighter for tomorrow as well as for Friday, and temperatures trend a bit warmer, too. Right now, we're still in the low and mid 30s throughout inland Connecticut, close to 40 along the 95 corridor. And we do have this southwesterly wind. Yesterday, it was northerly, so it helped to bring in some of that chilly air that we started the day with, but now the wind has switched to the southwest helping to bring in uh, some relatively milder air. But regardless of wind direction, when you factor in the wind, it makes it feel several degrees colder uh, across the state. So you'll still want to dress appropriately accordingly this afternoon if you're heading out and about. We do have a our right can view here from New Haven showing fairly overcast conditions uh, really all across the state. There's the view from Torrington as well as from stores also into our capital city. In fact, from here you can see a few patches of blue as we look toward the east and southeast over the Connecticut River. There's the top of 777 Maine. Uh, so within the clouds, you can see on early warning pinpoint Doppler just some light shades of blue popping up over this 30-minute uh, animation here showing perhaps a few flurries, a little brief snow shower, but shouldn't be too impactful this afternoon. And while there are more snow showers off to our west through Pennsylvania and New York, notice on Futurecast how it really dries them up as they head into southern New England. So uh, don't be surprised if you see some flakes flying around this afternoon. Any sort of accumulation should, should, should be minor and really confined to the northwestern hill towns. And then uh, clearing gets underway this evening. And then throughout the day tomorrow, we'll certainly see see a much brighter day uh, with a partly to mostly sunny sky and uh, temperatures trend even milder. So we'll start tomorrow uh, near 30 as opposed to teens and 20s like this morning. Tomorrow afternoon mid 40s close to 50 mostly sunny as we close out the week. Then for the upcoming weekend we'll see an increase in cloud cover Saturday perhaps some late day showers with the arrival of a warm front. Highs could reach the low if not mid 50s and then over the second half of the weekend several degrees warmer than Saturday with a continued chance for showers does not look like a washout as a cold front moves through behind that will trend cooler and windy as of right now next week still looks to be dry and cool with temps near 40 for highs Monday and Tuesday the wind will be up on Monday for shoreline highs this weekend forecasting 54 on Saturday then 57 on Sunday.